Right, Mensa. And I uh, live at uh, Asalaja Residential. And uh, we are the victim of uh, the flood that have occurred last week. And uh, we have a meeting as well that um, by next week Sunday, all the landlords around will be putting their mind together that we can do a contribution, that we can go to the district as well for if any donation that the government can support us, that we can go and wide the, the, the river Dinsu. Because due to the surveying that we have survey and see, that is the only problem that we think, the only solution that we think if we do, it can help us as well. So this is what we have as a community as well. Thank you very much. Hello family, welcome to Ben Archer TV channel. My name is Archer and um, we are here to give you an update of the Asha Laja flight. Exactly a week ago, this place was not a kind or a very nice scene to experience. The Dinsu River caused havoc and this part of the road or this stretch of the road heading from uh, Ashalaja to Amasaman was divided into two. In fact, the, those who know this highway a lot, this part is not too far from the shell filling station. And as you can see, where I have zoomed in, the road was cut into two. That means no car goes, no car comes. So the community was cut off uh, that's in between Ashalaja, uh, that's heading into the Ashalaja township. And the Dinsu River caused a lot of havoc. Three, four, five days after on, the flooding had uh, reduced and the water levels had gone down and the people have gotten back to their normal activities. But uh, the problem hasn't been still resolved. Those uh, who actually had built on the waterways are still having their building positioned there without any demolition effected. And like I told you, the only thing the government of Ghana did was to put sand in between the road so that the cars can make their movement from Kaswa to Amasaman. And I'll get you that shot pretty shortly. And see, this was the damage the Dinsu River caused to the road. It washed away the road, and you can see the erosion is everywhere. Look at the nature of the erosion as I'm giving you this live shot. Look at the nature of the erosion here and the problem hasn't been resolved and this is very dangerous especially for drivers that are community on this stretch because if you are not used to the stretch you can even veer off the road and fall into this ditch that is on this highway and this is a debacle look at the trap here and all was caused by the dense river so you can see the point that was filled with sand yeah this was a point just to enable the cars move or ply their routes so that is it. We are live on the Ben Archer TV channel. My name is Archer. And look at this trap on the Amasaman Kaswa Highway. And this is Laja. Look at the, the erosion that has been caused by the Dinsu River. And up to now, this is a death trap, and the government officials from the Gansout municipality are clueless, are thoughtless, and are inhumane. And look at what is happening here. Very humane. Look at what is happening here. Oh, Jesus. So some of the water levels are yet to drop out of there, and this is very serious. Yes, we are still live at Ashalaja, giving you this update on the Ben Archer TV channel. So it is what it is.